Another guy that's uh, in person, one of the free agent signings uh, by the by the Browns, and maybe almost a forgotten man after the draft. Anthony Walker, the linebacker, um, a, a guy that by all accounts a, a huge reason for the Colts defense having so much success. Let's listen to what Kevin Stefanski had to say about Walker as well as Walker uh, talking about being at OTAs. I would say as advertised, you know, you're playing that Mike linebacker position, you're directing traffic, you're getting everybody lined up, you in a lot of ways are the quarterback of the defense. And to see him communicate, to see his leadership uh, on display uh, in, in these type of settings is very impressive. And I think he's the type of guy that, that uh, you know, we think embodies the, the type of, of, uh, of style of play, uh, the type of uh, person we want in that locker room. Just to uh, get here, uh, again, first first year in a, a new system, um, get some new terminology, some new communication, um, which is huge. At, you know, definitely as the Mike linebacker, um, you know, getting that communication, getting that uh, that comfortability with the team and everybody. Um, I think that's a huge, huge, um, you know, for my job description, uh, a huge step in the right direction. So me being here was uh, pretty much a no brainer. And Dennis, I think you know we forgot just how important he can be as a middle linebacker that can run and tackle. Yeah, and I said on a previous show with you, Dave, that, you know, he, he doesn't strike me as a guy with, you know, with eye-popping stats or, or that he makes uh, ridiculous plays every single week, but he's a glue guy. He's a guy you definitely need if you want to have success. And when I – I don't want to take anything away from anybody else I'm not mentioning when I – uh, mentioned these three guys in particular on the defense, actually four, but Miles, the cerebral Miles Garrett, and, you know, Walker, the very, very bright guy, uh, John Johnson, the third, the quarterback of the back end, the Joker, uh, Jeremiah Wusu Koromal, you know him to be extremely intelligent. I'm sure other guys are very, very intelligent on the defense too, but the bottom line is you feel like you have a unit or Joe Woods has a unit now that is not only athletic and not only, uh, you know, faster than it's been, but can think the game as well as any unit that we've seen defensively in this town in a long time. 